So today we're just with Tony Rasmussen from Bailey's in Gisborne. Um, Raz, tell me us a little bit ba about Bailey's. What do you do? Uh, Bailey's is a, uh, obviously a nationwide uh, real estate company. Um, locally here in Gisborne, we um, we cover the field of uh, commercial real estate, uh, rural real estate, and, and residential real estate. And how many people do you employ here locally? Uh, here in Gisborne, we have a staff of twenty. Your salespeople and support staff. And why do you think people like living and working in Gisborne? Gisborne's a fantastic place, nice warm sunny, sunny climate, um, um, and, and it's, it's small enough that you, you know a lot of people and uh, we don't have traffic, uh, too many traffic jams and all those sort of issues that a lot of other parts of the world have in, in, in the cities. Awesome. Um, and what sort of internet connection does your business currently have? We have, uh, yeah, we have uh, broadband uh, and wireless um, and, and we know the benefit of, of having speedy internet here but to obviously um, if we were to, um, to, get to, to, to get that even faster it would make a huge difference to, um, huge difference to, to our town and our region. Awesome. So what are some of the ways you think ultra-fast broadband could change the way your company does business in the future? Um, I think certainly that a lot of people are looking at real estate online uh, and, and, um, and there's so much information and, um, um, passed around electronically nowadays and, and whether it's photographs or whether it's contracts and you're doing solicitors or, um, or, or people out in the more, more remote areas of our region had, um, had faster internet access would certainly improve the efficiencies within, within our business and I know how much of a difference that would make to, to our town and our, and our region um, for sure, yeah. What about, um, do you guys do virtual tours of houses of people that are shopping overseas? Do you think that would be something? We, we do and it's something that certainly is becoming um, um, something that people are keener on and certainly we, uh, we, we would like to do more of that and certainly faster. Um, Faster broadband, faster internet would, would, would help us do that. Would, uh, uh, would, would help a lot of people from out of the region who may may or may want to come and, and sample real estate here, but but they they can't travel here. So by, by having a virtual tour, that would allow them to sort of have a, have a look um, without have, actually having to come here. So. And what role do you think the business community will play in turning the winning giga town into a truly smart city? Well, I think. Um, um, Certainly, um, Giga Town, and, and it's a fantastic initiative. And basically, by getting uh, faster internet access, um, yeah, um, it would make a huge difference to our region, as I mentioned. Um, and, and I think the business community, uh, we're the ones that are, I guess, see the benefits and, and know how um, how. You know, how beneficial it can be to our whole region because we're using internet each and every day. And so um, by the business community getting behind it, uh, then we can pass that on and, and, and create that enthusiasm um, for the um, for mums and dads and families at home. Awesome. Um, and please finish the sentence. If Gisborne won Giga Town. If Gisborne won Giga Town, I would say it would be a massive benefit to our region. Um, uh, it would break down probably some of the isolation barriers and, um, and I, th I think uh, we, would, we would see an increase in probably property prices as a result of it so we would all benefit locally um, and, and I mean there's probably a lot of people that would like the concept of living in a place like Gisborne but um, internet and, and speed of internet um, probably breaks down and you know uh, it's an, yeah, certainly if we got it, we'd improve, uh, improve the number of people wanting to, to live here, so it be all good. Fabulous, thank you so much, Tony, um, and thanks for being with, with us today. No problems, thanks. okay.